Hello everybody, just with Lucky 8 Off-Road and we've got it, you've asked for it, a CFE rear ladder for the new Defender. As you know, we created the first rear ladder for the Defender back in 2020 and it has been a great success. The only problem is it's not cheap. We get it, it's like $1,300. It's made in America, stuff is expensive here, the quality is amazing, but if you're looking for a more cost-friendly ladder, that's what we've got today. Our CFE cost-friendly edition rear ladder for the Defender L663. Uh, I'm gonna show you all about it and I'm gonna show you how to install it. Cue the intro. First thing we need to do is get the rear bumper off. I go step by step, screw by screw in the Proud Rhino ladder install video. I'll put a link in the description. If you need help getting the bumper off, watch that. I take uh, a deep dive in how to get all the little clips and pieces off for you. So I don't wanna do that again in this one. Let's just jump to now with everything off. All right, over here, is where we need to mount our little bracket. That's gonna be the lower ladder support. I'm gonna bring the camera and show you the two bolt locations that we use, and we'll tighten this up. You need to find this piece of plastic held on with the two 10 mil head bolts. Get it out of the way. Yes, I know this is on the right-hand side, but mine's already been removed. This is what it looks like with the plastic removed. We need to use these two bolts these two bolt locations. I'm going to move the harness out of the way, slide it behind, tighten it down. Okay, next up is to put on the beauty plate. I'm gonna put the Proud Rhino ladder back on the Ultimate 90. So I'm not going to remove this, this just pops off. So when you're doing your bumper piece, you're just gonna pop this little lower trim off and um, then your beauty plate will fill in. For this exercise, I'm just gonna set it in place, put a couple bolts in it, like so. And then we'll move on to the uh, top section. You're gonna wanna find this little piece. It sits right in here in the track. We're gonna drop that in and then we can bolt the top section to it. Here's the top section. We're just gonna set it in place and tighten it down with the two nuts. All right, we are almost there. I'm gonna start with the long bolts in the bottom just to align it. Then uh, the two top ones. We'll tighten everything down, job done. Well, there you have it, not a hard job. The most difficult part is getting the bumper cover off. Just take your time with all those clips and be careful when you're, you're pulling it right here, but just bolting it up, super easy, and it's ready to go. All right, guys, I'm gonna bring it outside, get you some beauty shots, and we'll see you on the next one.